Right, hello, um, the entire one person that's watching this. Hi Sam, um, you're a cunt, fuck you, um, just as revenge for when you said it to me. Uh, so I have changed the, uh, fuck me, um, names, because tier lists with no actual, um, just kind of cringe if they don't have any meaning to the levels. If it was like writing them 1 out of 10, anything better than just random fucking numbers. Come on, mate, we're not in secondary school anymore. I'm not doing my maths GCSE. Um, I have gone ahead, and as far as I'm aware, those, what, 21 series are the ones before the Flesh series, which was the first one uh, that I watched. And I have put them all in this character category called Haven't Watched It All, in case you can't read. Um, I am almost certain that I haven't watched any of them. They bring back absolutely no memories. Um, but at the same time, um, I'm, I'm looking at these and... <laughs> Was this one that I've watched? You know, you know what? Hold on. Um, I'm not gonna do that because I don't know if I've watched these two, these three. Um, and if if there is a lot filling up in this, I have apparently watched it but can't remember doing so category. Um. If there's a lot filling up in there, then those three are going straight in there as well, but see how it goes. Um, so yeah, audibly laughed out loud multiple times during the series. Uh, audibly laughed out loud a few times, or have very fond memories of, have fond memories of, and then I can remember watching it. I can remember, oh, they were living in the... Volcanic uh, pyroclastic overflow or some shit like that. I remember them living there in sort of a bit about a base design. But my fucking god, if you ask me anything about this series. Other than there was... Was it? Was it? I don't know which one it was. I think it was this one, right? Where they were coming together to make one ultimate evil character which was Susan um, and I think part of it was that one of the characters was stuck oh no I think that was the second Anne one right yeah Anne was stuck being downed and you were like oh it's going to take forever to get her back to being whatever, um, alive and shit, we're gonna have to win so many raids and harvest so many organs, and you did it in, like, the first two episodes. Um. So. I am actually gonna add a robe below. Uh, I can remember parts of the series, but not that much. Uh, and now I'm going to have to go through and I'm gonna put this as like grey. It's more of a grey thing, right? Um, so I am going to grab uh, the and one, I can remember parts of the series, but not that much. Um, and I will fully admit, this is going to be incredibly biased. Um, simply because, as as someone who is a viewer, who is not uh, the person creating them, my 
relationship with the content is obviously going to be fucking different. This is... Um... Two years? Is that it? Yeah, okay. So it is... Jesus. I have been watching you for almost three years. Like, give or take a, a week or a fortnight or so. Um, so yeah, this is three years. If I look back on what I was doing three years ago, shit was pretty fucking different. Um, I've had computers break, uh, which is why I think the um, this one is going to be unfairly higher than the rest of them, simply because I didn't have a fucking computer. I was stuck watching, you know, my eyes on the screen of the YouTube videos. Um, whereas most of the time, I, I just leave shit playing in the background. Um, and so I'm going to come up here and I'm going to put it in that one. Um, have I actually watched this one? <laughs> um, yeah. Because I, I remember that one quite well. Um, there was the big base and there was like the palisades and everything was uh, getting constantly broken in by zombies. And I remember that one fairly well because at the time my computer was completely broken. Um, and it took me about two months to get it fixed. Um, because AMD are cunts and don't really, well, no, it wasn't really AMD's fault. It was more Amazon's fault. Um, trying to get a, a motherboard to work with a uh, AMD chip, something about BIOS update, blah, blah, blah. Took forever to figure the fuck out. Um, and this is what was going on at that time. And so, I remember it more than I should have. Let's put it that way. Um, I will say, I have watched, like, odd episodes. There have been times where I've gone back and been like, there is fucking nothing to do. And I'm just going to watch some of the old shit. And then realise that, dear Christ, I value my ears a bit too much. Um, do not jump ahead. Like, what... Now, that's another thing that's going to be a bit biased uh, with this. Is, yeah, of course I'm going to fucking remember the most recent series. Which one came before this? <laughs> uh, it was the Ungus Bungus. Um, God, I'm really fucking saying words out loud. Was it this one? On Rome, what? Yeah, it was this one. Um, I did also add in the, the two missing... Well, the one missing series and, and the one that should have been a fucking series... Uh, this one is going, is it? I'm, I'm going to put it at the top of that one. And I, I am just really, <laughs> I said on the video that this thing comes from, I kind of don't like wave-based survival because it's far too formulaic and eliminates a lot of the uh, spontaneous shit. It eliminates a lot of the randomness and, and whatever. Um, but at the same time, I'm putting that series at the top so far, which... Am I just fucking retarded or a hypocrite? I... God, no idea. Um, the first and series... Um, I'm gonna be honest, and put it there, because, alright, okay, I remember Anne, because how funny anime waifu woman, um, I remember that, anyway, moving on, um, <laughs> yeah, it, it, 
it just really didn't... I can't remember anything about it. I can't remember the base design. I can't remember any of the other characters. I can't remember anything that's happened in that series. And so I think... No, it's got to go in there. Um, this one is very close to being in this bottom tier. Um, the Susan series is going right at the top. And I, I'm going to say that the 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 most impact uh, uh, like fucking a YouTube video series um, or even just a one-off, the most impact that it can have on me that I would like categorize is it made me download RimWorld and play it. I remember playing this one. I remember creating a big fucking horrific, ugly as sin um, Christmas tree base, like Christmas tree shaped base on that fucking island, and it was horrible, and I hated it, and I gave her way too many fucking bionics and powers. She moved far too quick, the game was lagging horribly, and I just quit, because I have no obligation to give a series an end, so I can just quit when I am bored. Um, Seven Daily Sins, as I say, um, I can remember the base layout, I can remember the thing, and I can roughly remember some of what happened. Oh, can I? Not really. It's It will be at the bottom. Of, of this one. Um, I'm going to bump you up to the top. Uh, once again, heavily biased. Uh, just from how recent it is. It, it's going to stay at the bottom. Because I can remember some of what happened. But not. Not that much. Um, plus also I fully admit with this. Tearing system. Heavily biased uh, towards nostalgia. Um. Rimworld ideology. If if you told me that this one came before Flesh, I would believe you. Um, similar. I I cannot fucking remember them at all. This one. Um, I'm gonna put at the top. Um, This is like the the separation line. You know, I, I'm actually going to change the colours. Uh, and I'm going to go... Like this. Right? Because... These ones I remember, at the same time, I remember walking home from school, uh, sorry, school, um, I remember walking home from seeing my ex, uh, when we were dating at one point, um, and seeing a helicopter fly over on the sunset, and I remember that, and I remember the photo I took of it, there's two of them, and one of them, there is a bush blocking the, the helicopter. Um, I remember that. D does that mean anything? Does that mean I want to fuck a helicopter or some shit? No. It, it just means that my brain is fucking broken and has... Just remembers random shit for pointless reasons. Um, so th this is, like, complementary up here in these three. And then the bottom three is just, like... You know what I mean? <laughs> um, I remember watching it. I remember you starting in um, one of the like pre-made things where it's a bit like that island map where it's a 
a, a big um, mountain, you know, in quotations, mountain uh, in the middle of the map. And there's a base inside it and, and shit like that. And you were testing out the new mod and all that. And it was just that. That's it. I who are these people? I don't have a fucking clue. I can't tell you what happened, what the base ended up looking like. I can't tell you any of that shit. I think that there was a sort of outside bit for occasionally you would get random quests of like offering labor or some shit and there would be people that would come in and there was like a little L-shaped thing at the bottom left of the base and that was where all of those like transient people where they stayed I think I remember something like that but remembering a bit of the base design like it's it's nothing compared to you know other things where I remember the entire base design uh, and things that happened um This one, also very good. I, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> These two, um, I can't remember the base at all. I cannot remember anything about these. But what I can remember is liking them, and I remember laughing at them and thinking, "Wow, th this is funny." I'm glad I'm watching this uh, rather than just say, like, "Oh." This thing's going on in the background type thing. Um, so I remember that. Um, oh, God. It's... No, I think I have to put it above... I think I'm going to reorder it to be like that. Because I can remember quite a bit of the Rise of Rome uh, base design. I can't remember the base design of these two. Well, sorry, of these three. Actually, I remember there being a castle in like the top middle. Uh, that sort of... The courtyard was... Um, Like, there, there was a courtyard that came out and was just in the air. And then, like, the inner sanctum uh, was where Anne lived. Or was that this one? I don't know. I, I cannot tell the fucking difference between those two. I didn't even realise there was a second series. Um, This one. Because it was fucking goofy. It was just... Brain dead shit. Didn't make any sense. But it was, like, in a good way. I can't remember anything of the base design. I can't remember anything like that. I can just remember the fucking alien queens. And all of the, the random things coming in. And just getting absolutely fucked every single episode. And it was just kind of funny. Um, straight bottom tier, I, uh, top of the bottom tier, because I think that that one's General Joe, <laughs> um, I don't know who any of those six are, well, sorry, of those eight, um, It's going there. Because I can definitely remember it. And at the time, that was like, once again, I am saying this to like fully admit my bias. So it's, you know, more obvious. But at the time when I was watching that, that was the first time I ever saw the whole, um, was it Rim, Rim Factory? Which... You remember, like, Tekkit and Project E, the RimWorld version of that. That, like, OP shit in original Yogscast Tekkit. That 
was the first time that I saw the, the RimWorld version of it. And so I do have quite fond memories of it. And I remember the base design quite well. And it was a shitty, boring old kill box. And I remember that in the top left, there was a load of those like auto miner things and a load of crafters. Um, and they were churning out God knows what. I can't remember that bit, but I do remember sort of that. And I do remember enjoying the series and tabbing out to watch it. Uh, rather than just listen to it a bit more than, say, the ones below it. Uh, Mech Defense Force. I think. I think. At least. So I think the, the base was a big circle-y thing. And there was like a... You know what I mean? It was like a big circle. There was the thing coming in from one part. And that one part got bricked up. But it never mattered because the mechanoids just always sent drop pods. And I think in the end you used like... Was it anti-matter annihilation? Use some. It was Alpha and Beta Poly. Uh, this one. I've just remembered that. Um, yeah, the antimatter annihilation. Those like massive turrets, and you just spammed them down, and even then, did shit. But I, I guess for that reason, I have to put it. I guess I have to put it there. Was this chainsaw hands? I don't know. Uh, this one. Straight top tier. This one was like these these ones down here. Do doesn't matter. Anything below this one. Fucking doesn't matter, right? When it was, um, it was four, uh, when this one was coming out, I believe, um, I, I would sit there, 3.58, I would be sitting there on YouTube watching the clock, spamming F5, I want to watch the fucking daily episode of Rimworld Santa Nazi Christmas. I... Remember very fondly the base design. I remember laughing out loud a lot. I remember the constant fucking zombies and the exploit for the gene seeds or whatever the 40k shit was. I remember Santa going around fucking bombing people. I remember the, um, like, absolute brain dead balancing uh, for the power clause, I think it was, where it's like. Explosive bullets dealing more than enough damage to kill a person in the explosion that had a big radius and it's got 5,000 melee DPS. Shit like that. I remember this one. I think I played along with this as well. I am fairly sure I did at least. Um, this is like fitting. Um, these two are the series that sort of, how do you say it? You know like when someone, like a creator uh, on YouTube, they put out a video or series of videos that change how you view the rest of their content. You know, like, that you sort of, you don't change how you look at them as a person, but just the existence of these two series makes me look at the rest of them in a different way. And not in a negative way, but more of a... God, how do you describe it? 
It's like these. Well, I, I mean, flesh isn't really applicable because that was the first. But this one was what took it from. Uh, yeah, I watch this guy for half an hour a day. I kind of leave him on in the background, and it's you know I I tab in, and and there's a funny Maggie Thatcher getting her milk as milk, um, every so often, and and all that shit. It took it from being that to I am sitting there at four p.m. Bang on, spam F five. Where's the fucking video? 401, I am in the Discord. Where the fuck is it, Sam, you cunt? You promised me a video. Where the fuck is it? Um, shit like that. Mainly a result from this one. I'm gonna be honest. Um, has kind of dwined. Um, just because... I, I don't know. That's, that's just how it naturally works. It just hasn't been... There hasn't been something where I've sat and the entire episode just laughed at it. And sure, okay, that might be just me. That might be, you know, oh, I'm burnt out on RimWorld. It might be any of those things. But at the end of the day, you put out a fucking whatever. You know, hey, tell me about the series. Give your ranking on them. And I'm giving you my ranking. I don't give a shit if I'm biased, if I'm burnt out on Rimworld, or if I don't give a shit about you anymore, whatever, um, about your content, sorry. Um, but this one, supremely top tier. And the question is, which one comes first? And that's a genuinely hard question. Because. I just. Don't know. <laughs> um, this is the one that got me into the channel. This is the one that. Made me like a big fan of the channel. This is why I started watching. This is why I kept watching. Which one is a bigger compliment? And I'm going to leave it as it is, because that's just how I've put it there, and I'm not going to change it. Um, this one is going there. Uh, it's going there. It's going right at the bottom of having fond memories, but I do remember enjoying that series. Sure, it was kind of boring, but I remember some of the parts that happened. You know, sending down people into the mines and forgetting to send food with them, I'm fairly sure was a thing. Um, I remember the big, like, oil, like, concreting over this nice um, biome to oil industry and we live in a society, it's reflective of real life and all that shit. Um, but I, I remember that, and I remember enjoying this uh, while it lasted. And yeah. I, I think that's all I can say about it, because I somewhat remember the base design, but at the same time, uh, I, if you ask me to name the seven dwarves, anyway, so, uh, Rimworld, yeah, yep, and I don't even know if I've watched those. No, I don't think I have, I haven't, I haven't watched those. Um, what the fuck even is this? Was this the questing one? Is that what that is? God, I can't even read the fucking title from the thumbnail. Um, where is it? 
No, it's not that one. Um, yeah, it was the questing one. I can put it up up there. So I remember the guild. I remember shit like that, and I I can remember sort of you know sending off three parties, and I remember you always came back with like shitty. Um, oh, we we opened a grave, and there's a golden chalice in there, and it's like. Woohoo, we've got 50 silver. Fuck yes. And the quest rewards were fucking shit. They were just nothing. Um, but at the same time, I do remember the guild. I remember all that. I remember it burning down. And I think it was Dr. Phil. Uh, someone being stuck at the guild. Uh, and I think they were incapable of firefighting or some shit like that. And... For some reason, the guild burnt down, um, and that was pretty funny. Um, you see, the thing is, I don't know if I'm gaslighting myself. <laughs> I don't know if I remember this series, or if I don't. I don't know if what I'm thinking of is that one. I don't know if I'm confusing those two series. Um, and so, I'm going to come in here and I'm going to do a smart thing and look at the fucking thumbnails. Um... Yeah, okay, so it was the one I was thinking of. And so I'm, I'm going to put it... Hmm. If I gave The Rise of Rome, can't remember watching it, but can't remember anything about the series, a high in that tier. Um, it, it's got to go there. I remember the giant fucking thing at the end. I remember... Was it this one? I remember this bit. That's it. That's all I can remember. Uh, I can remember the base design being a big hexagon, but if I'm being honest, the hive. You you tell me that name of a series, and you say, "What do you think the base design is going to look like, little friend?" I'm going to say it's going to be a fucking hexagon. It's going to be bee based because it's called a fucking hive. It, it, remembering that it's a hexagon is meaningless when it's it's a shape. That's not a base, that's fucking geometry. I can't remember anything that happened in there other than that I think Bugsy was the queen uh, and she was in the middle. Um, other than that, no fucking clue. Remembering that there was a big hexagon and the queen slept in the middle that's not enough to put it into. I can remember parts of the series. This one. Is going. I, I can remember it more than the Anne and Mona series. And I can remember it less than the questing series, so it's going in the middle. I can remember round. And I can remember breeding. Or oh, sorry, was it, was it breeding or was it laying? I remember something, something like sending out a caravan of about 50 people, all armed with the most basic, I forget what they were, but it was some sort of like bug weapon that was basically just a fucking slingshot, and I can remember you sending out about 50 of them, and they went to, what was it, it was like called a citadel or something, it was some super long map, and you had to go through like 
kill box after kill box after kill box to get to the final bit and you were there for so long that you could just keep sending more and more and more chunks of 50 colonists in or like 20 whatever you just kept sending more in because you were breeding them so quick that by the time that the first lot made any progress the map was so fucking long that they weren't even close to the end and so you just sent more of them in um and then the thing ended and i'm gonna prove myself because it's gonna be uh oh jesus was it really that long ago yeah tribal skeletons versus an empire citadel wow look here's the thing that i said exactly what would happen 50 colonists against an empire citadel it, it's it's almost as if this series was memorable and i can remember parts about it uh, and so for that reason i'm gonna bump it up 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 the park because it says park there <laughs> um monkeys versus zombies yeah do i rate it higher than the pirate series yes yes i do um i remember the base design being all bananas i remember the weapons being all bananas i remember the actual building blocks being all bananas and i remember the the weapons being all bananas uh and the um food being all bananas and i remember that the cure for being a zombie was a banana i remember the base design i remember the was it like just dr monkey or some shit like that um and then there was there was some name like zagreus which i know is the guy from hades but there was something like that uh, in there who was like the big muscly guy who comes around with the big banana and boosh on the head i think um but yeah no i remember that one and i remember you getting like incredibly pissed off when the zombies just decided actually we're not zombies anymore we're just normal colonists we're just normal raiders we've discovered fire and we're gonna burn your base down fuck you um while your guys were in there and then they got swarmed by zombies i think and most of them um got bitten and then there was like a, a big rush of oh i've only got enough to make you know one magical banana who am i gonna save and shit like that i can remember it quite well i remember enjoying this series thumbs up this one let me just double check <laughs> um um i think it must be right unless it was the one right before no oh they're right after each other okay that makes a lot of sense then <laughs> um i'm gonna be honest i've completely forgot what i was even looking for it was that close that is going right at the fucking bottom then if it was that re it was after fucking the pharaoh series one with the... oh yeah no i remember that now i'm not going to change the um i'm, I'm not going to change my opinion i'm not going to move it on the tier list but i remember it now it was the one with all of the um like the base design was it was in a little cubby in a mountain and then there was like a kill box uh where it was like a proper kill box with turrets all around the side um 
coming off. And then there was like a courtyard uh, that had a few turrets, uh, a line of sandbags, and there was all of those mech things. And it was all surrounding a mountain, aside from like the the right of the screen. And I believe it was on that. Um, is it like called a mechanoid inclusion or something like that map? Um, but look, if I can't remember it from this, then it means I can't remember it. Looking at thumbnails and having to scroll down almost to the end of the series before I realize, oh, it was the one with the mechs. Then that that doesn't count. That that goes right at the bottom. Admittedly, I can remember it more than those three now that I've looked at it. But being so recent and being completely immemorable, straight to the fucking bottom with you. Um, do I put it here or here? I'm going to put it there. Because I think I enjoyed this series. I don't think I enjoyed that much as a series. I think that I enjoyed watching you enjoy something. I think I enjoyed half an hour of here's a guy that's really enjoying what he's doing and it comes across in the video. I can remember most of the base design. I can remember quite a lot of what happened. But I... I can't remember enjoying the series for the series. I remember enjoying the series for the person making the series enjoying the series. Which... You know, I can, I can say the same about, like... Um, I can say the same about Stardew Valley or um, Minecraft, yes. Um, I, I can say the same about those because Minecraft, you're playing fucking basically vanilla minecraft yawn what is this xbox in 20 fucking 12 boring stardew valley i could go outside and farming game <laughs> jesus fucking christ um but yeah i i remember watching shit like that and enjoying it more because could tell that the person recording it was enjoying it essentially yep <laughs> um did i just scroll right by it <laughs> um Looking at all of this, and yeah, no, uh, no clue, but this one is less recent than that one, and so that's why I'm going to put them in those orders, because I think it was more egregious for something to be as forgettable, but more recent. Can't tell you shit about this. Arco Nexus. Yep. There, there isn't much to say because I can't fucking remember anything about it. Rimworld Genetics. Um, have I even watched this one? Is a good question. Um, where is the Flash series? Is there? So we are looking for genetics. Could I just control F this? Yes, I could. Genetics is right around the...
was this pissing around with the um it was the thing with the yeah the hybridization of the animals i remember that um but at the same time i didn't remember it from the thumbnail. And so it's going there. It's going one above because I can remember more of what happened. Okay, it's. No, I will not allow post rating events to change my opinion. I'm not a fucking games journalist. I can remember a fair bit of what happened. But at the same time, I couldn't when I just looked at it. Instant. This entire... Like, just around here... This... This patch of uh, 18... These three rows... I, what, what are these? D did I what? Did I watch those? <laughs> I know I did because I can remember the Terraria series. You're telling me that Seven Dwarves came before this one? You're telling me Seven Dwarves came after the art? Actually, no, that does sound kind of right. I remember the Catharsis one coming after the RPG one and being somewhat recent um but yeah um fuck it no clue i i but um, yeah is um <laughs> my my opinion on on those um this one oh is going to be hard I'm going to put it at the lowest level of the highest tier. Because I remember the cringe corridor and I remember fucking pissing myself every single time that it fucked up. And it was just an abomination. It was completely fucking useless. A complete waste of time. And that was why I liked it. I like watching you waste your fucking life. Like spending 50 minutes listening to some retard who doesn't give a shit. Um... That's that's wrong. I, I care about you deeply, Sammy Whammy. Um, Jesus Christ. Uh, Google parasocial relationship for me. Rimworld Heroes. Um, I'm going to put there. Because I think that that was the one with the big power thing. Um, uh, the, the superpowers and... I think it was like one of the first things that happened uh, was one of the guys got like his legs paralyzed and like, got stuck in a fucking wheelchair and that was the other one who had the uh, double range, 100% accuracy, uh, sorry I don't think it was 100%, I think it was plus 100% accuracy, uh, so like double accuracy basically. Um, so double range, double accuracy, and it was the one that always hit vital organs uh, in combat. And I think that character accidentally killed someone in a social fight, if I'm remembering correctly, because it was combat and they punched like right in the brain or something and just killed them. Um, and so I'm going to put it there in retrospect. This one was the one with Fat Larry. And it was the one where the, uh, it was definitely back here somewhere. Um, it was the one with the special Larry minigun. Fat Larry's golden shower. I, I remember that and it shoots little Jorises. Um, yeah, I, I remember this. Um, and I remember enjoying that series. 
I don't think it is quite on the same level of enjoyment for, for me. Um, but I do definitely remember enjoying that series. I think a lot of... No, I, I think that this one is just... I remember really enjoying it. But I can't remember much about it. I remember that I liked this series. A bit... A bit like some of the other ones up here. I remember liking it. I remember laughing at it. But... God, I... I... I could not write you a synopsis. Um... Unky Bunky. Um... Do I? I think I do. Because if I'm considering the whole series as a whole, then I think that um, the end was shit. Let's be honest, the end was just fucking bad. Um, the good was beginning, and the bad was ending, is uh, my Yoda impression of a review of the series. Catharsis. Goes to the bomb. Because uh, I can remember quite enjoying the um, the first few episodes of like I've created a mod pack that's gonna be super easy. I've given myself a load of shit, and yeah, I'm gonna be Mister Void, and I'm gonna pew pew the bad people, and I'm gonna I'm gonna laugh, and I'm gonna enjoy it, and then you get your legs ripped off and left to bleed out endlessly by a random void monster. I remember that. Granny's Ranch, um, I, I can't remember much about it, the only thing that I can really remember is a bit of the base, I can remember quite a lot of the base design to be fair, uh, which is why it's going in the top tier, and I remember that the Muffalo gang only up to like 10%, you know, it, it went from like 110% fluff to 120%, in like the entire series and it was completely pointless and i remember you built a giant railway um from top to bottom of the map on the left side and you were living out in like a desert or some shit like um i don't know the word for it but like outback australian outback type biome whatever the fuck you call that um and there was absolutely no rocks, but the, um, no, they're not called sleepers, but the thing you put underneath sleepers, um, like the, uh, the fucking rocks that people use for building trainways, um, trainways, god, I am fucking smart, um, railways, I, I remember those, and you spent fucking ages getting chunks to build a decorative railway, and you finished it, like, two episodes before the fucking series ended, so it was pointless. Um, Vehicle Wars is going right at the bottom of that one, uh, because I can remember quite a lot of the uh, running random people over, uh, getting pissed off that the tanks would not do the tanking properly um just you being shit at the game uh i remember that um and i i do quite i do remember quite enjoying that series as well um but not as much as like these 
especially nowhere near as much as those. What the fuck does that say? I think this is the vampire one, um, right? Oh, okay, that's definitely not a vampire one, is it? Was this not? Hold on. Oh, the neighborhood you. is bustling with flavor. You know what? Yeah, all right. That is not um you <laughs> bombed it instantly. I think it might be Where even did I what? I think it must be that one then. Um was the vampires in the big chasm um to the point where i'm going to come up to jesus um yay yeah no it was okay I'm not, I'm not going to change it. I just wanted to settle that for my own uh, research. I can't remember jack shit about that one. Cat girls in a cave. In brackets worshipping Cthulhu. I am going to put this one. In between Egypt and the Dwarf series. And I'm going to bump the Dwarf series down a bit. Just because I remember you enjoying that one uh, a fair bit. Having fun with the concept. And it coming across. And I just... Absurdist whack shit. And I enjoyed it. Simple as that. Um... I can remember a lot of the series. I can remember. I can remember Pierre. I can remember hotboxing the Dryads. I can remember putting it up a tier. Because it, now that I sort of think about it a bit more. I think it does belong there. And I remember all of that shit. I remember Pierre and hotboxing Dryads. But like I said. And that's pretty much all I remember. Um. I think it was the lowest tier that I can... I think it was a bit too good to be like, oh, I remember watching it. I, it wasn't horribly forgettable, but I also can't say it was incredibly enjoyable, if that makes sense. I think it was just in the middle ground. The Ohm series goes up there because... Um, I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed watching it. I enjoyed uh, the things. I wouldn't say it was the funniest. But. <laughs> I, I was going to say like. Oh. Like my, my sense of humor. <laughs> my sense of humor half the time. Is watching. Um, like. Excited Chinese men talking Chinese about random fruit that they are. It's like, it's the most fucking retarded TikTok Zuma moment. Um, literally just Chinese men holding fruit and screaming at it. Um, well, um, oh, I forget the name of it, but, um, like, over the top traditional Chinese music, you know. You know what I mean, like the, um, oh, the one from that play, um, where it's, it's like if a, a man with Tourette's was reading a Chinese dictionary type thing, um, and just sped up, like, twice as quick, shit like that, just playing in the background, and so, 
that that's why laughing out loud is such a high rank for me if that makes sense um because my sense of humor isn't really rimworld unless you want to do like a chinese fruit series um but i i do remember really enjoying this one i i don't think it goes in the top tier though And this is the funniest episode that has um, ever been put out on the channel. Without exception. This is the single best thing on the channel. Every single episode of this series is less funny than this quarter of an hour one-off. It is half the length, but twice as funny at a bare fucking minimum. This should have been a series because it was fucking hilarious. Although those those two are, are very good, especially the Christmas one was really funny. Um, so I'm going to go through these ones. I'm not going to touch those because I think after after looking at some of them, uh, it has changed the. I, I, apparently, I watched it, but I can't remember. Apparently, it's it, it's like changed that uh, rating for me. Um, this one is still gonna stay at that level. I can remember watching it, but I can't remember anything about the series. Definitely belongs at the bottom. Because um, I I can remember the. The goal of the series was let's do the Arco Nexus thing, and each time he just did a different. Um, what's it called? You know, you sold drugs one time, or you sold weapons the other time, or you sold. I don't know, food, bionics, whatever, uh, the other time. Can't remember anything about it though, in particular. I do think that it deserves to be above. I think that that's a better um, ordering for those. I can't remember anything. Um, yeah, no, I'm going to have to stick with that, that lineup because I was thinking, but I remember having a castle and there was the peasants on the outside, uh, still within a wall, uh, but the peasants were outside under the air, um, and then Anne was in a big dugout castle in, in the back of that. I was going to say, I can remember that as well. And I can remember the, you know, there was like a load of weather effects all the time and, and shit like that. But then I remembered, I remember the base design of these better. And I can remember events from this one better. And so I think it stays there. Um, I definitely think that Seven Deadly Sins is as close to being in this tier as possible. Without actually being in that tier. I can remember jack shit about the series. But I can vividly remember some of the uh, like the base design and stuff like that. I think I, w I would even argue. I would argue that actually doing that no I 
I would argue that doing this is a better solution. And I, I stand by that being there. I don't know where to put it. I'm, I'm going to put it up here. Yeah, I'm going to put it at the lowest tier of I laughed at this. I found this thing funny. Yes, okay. Laughing at Maggie Thatcher being naked for a couple episodes is not the basis for a good series. But it's not a good series. And so I'm going to say I, I laughed at it and I'm going to put it in that category because I I think that out of all of them, aside from making a new one of Halloween series, it, it has to go up there. I remember enjoying these. But not really having great memories of the most of the series. So I think they belong there. I I think that, that belongs there. I I think those two have to go at the top. Um Do I prefer the Medieval Undead series to the Halloween series? Is a question that I ask myself, and I don't exactly know the answer for. I have very fond memories of the Medieval series, but I don't think it was a great series. At the same time, I'm going to do that. Do I prefer lactating Maggie Thatcher to Bucko Drink? No, of course I don't. No one would ever want that, which is why. <laughs> um, I, I, I. I remember enjoying this one quite a lot. And I cannot rate the Halloween series higher than that. Monkeys vs. Zombies was kind of a similar concept. Constant raids. Aside from, I think I prefer the Monkey Madness to um, Buoyant Buffoonery. <laughs> Jesus fuck. Um, I almost said Pirate Pedophilia. <laughs> <laughs> oh god yeah it wasn't a mortar sorry um yeah i'm gonna they're very close from what i remember so i'm gonna do that i'm not gonna demote them i'm gonna Demote something else and promote them instead. Arco Seed, yep, definitely. Um, top of very fond memories. And these were the funniest things um, out of all of them. I think that that is my... My tier list. And I'm not going to press download on recording because it will show my um, full name because... What 
why does it even do that? Why does Windows have my full name as a user? My username on Windows is uh, Rusk Grusk, um, also known as randomly mashing keys. Um, so I don't have to look at my name every single time I have a file I want to save because it's just a bit fucking strange, isn't it? Um, but yeah, that is my my RimWorld tier list. I hope you enjoyed wasting 70 minutes of your life. You could have been doing something productive in this time.